In this video, we are going to see how to lock a jobs better in a talent, right? We've been logging jobs in the previous video, but now we'll use in these settings to avoid what we've done here in the previous job, which was using those catcher components and their respective outputs. Okay, for one, we can not do that for asset catcher and its respective file output and delimited. So if you want to create that job, duplicate in this one and create a log job better job in your environment and then only leave the asset catcher in its related output there delete the other catcher components and their respective file output then you head over to the job tab and the sub tab stats and logs here you uncheck use project settings and you check this one this one and this one okay to have the equivalent then you have three options on where to show the log either one of those or several here I say two files, okay, and I want in this to go to talent and data uh, logs and directory, okay, and here I leave the names as they are, and for the asset file to have the same convention, I would call the other one asserts file and asserts underscore file dot txt uh, as I did here asset file dot txt. All right, one small limitation here is that we unfortunately cannot include a header in the files, but this is not too bad. But one advantage here also is that we can activate or deactivate completely on this level the component statistics. Okay, so if I want to continue with this like before, I just check in this box and here for the log catcher, we also have to decide what to log. User warnings are the T warns, user errors are the T dies, and runtime errors are uh, Java errors. Sometimes here in Talent, the name is not very, very consistent. So it's good to know. Uh, execute the job again. And now we have more files here uh, in our directory. As you can see, the other ones that I did not select now are from the previous execution where I had the job name included in the file name. So let's now open this one. We can here see the assert with the same content in log meter uh, and stats file with the same content. So it basically works the same way, only the configuration is made in another place. And that's what I mean by how to log and jobs better in talent.